and I represent Orumba North, Orumba South for the constituency, Mr. Speaker, from Anambra State. Uh, the announcement is uh, by way of uh, informing this Honorable House about the demise of Nigeria's former number two citizen, my number one citizen in the Orumba North Federal constituency, the person of Dr. Alex Ekweme, who on the 19th of uh, this month passed on at the age of 25 at the London Clinic. Mr. Speaker, you will recall that uh, Dr. Alex Ekweme was the first elected executive vice president of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, who has given the best of his contribution, the best of his intellect, the best of his experience in the service of his country. This was a man that doesn't rigorously or aggressively canvass for issues that concern him, but deployed his intellectual ability as a historian, as an architect, as a sociologist, as a, as a lawyer in designing uh, the, the six geopolitical uh, zones in the country during the National Constitutional Conference. Mr. Speaker, this gentleman served, was believed to have come out as a vice president poorer than he went in there, like uh, 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 President uh, uh, Mohammed Buhari. It is in view of all this that I am bringing to the knowledge of the, of the, of the floor of this house that Dr. Alex Ekweme, the former vice president of Nigeria, the man that chaired G37, G34, that metamorphosed into PDP, that took over the uh, power from military uh, rule in 2003. Mr. Speaker, I would want to share with you my, uh, my last uh, experience with him. He was talking to me about the Federal Polytechnic Oko and how he would wish that the place be upgraded to a Federal, a federal University of Technology. Uh, it is my prayer in, in the appropriate time that this House will consider it necessary that when I bring the appropriate legislative instruments that, that will upgrade the Federal Polytechnic Oko to a Federal University of Technology and rename it Dr. Alex Ekweme, Federal University of Technology, uh, Oko. Mr. Speaker, and my honorable colleagues, uh, this is by way of announcement. I would want Mr. Speaker also to oblige some other colleagues of mine who are from the same uh, 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 geopolitical zone to share their, their, their sentiments about this fallen Nigerian who gave the very best of his acumen in the service of his country. I end this note by recapturing what Mark Anthony said in his tribute to Caesar, that his life was so humble, the elements so mixed in him, that the whole world would rise and say this was a man. Indeed, Mr. Speaker, Dr. Alex Ekweme was a man and a true Nigerian. Thank you very much, Mr. Speaker. And we are only paying tribute to a very great leader only that all the speakers have forgotten to mention that Alex Ekweme was probably one of the highest educated Nigerians that we ever had, with almost like between 10 and 12 university degrees, no corresponding degrees, university degrees. So we all agree he was a great man, and we pray that his soul will rest in perfect peace.